Still 24 overs to go, the best part of 24 overs. in the air but always slicing away from long off does well in the end short pulled away we'll go for four nice shot clever shot because mid on is up big gap behind him Difficult shot, degree of difficulty was huge on this one. That's why it's good batting, trying to use this last over as much as possible. Just one to finish, been a pretty good one. Eight runs have come from it. Make that nine, we see that so much with England. Punish for hitting the stumps again. 185 for five, will become 186. Time so won't beat long off coming round. It's carved away of a backward point. High up in the air and all the way for six because the boundary is in a fair distance there because of the building work that has been going on in the corner. Still a good shot. He had a go at it with the full force. Top edge. But over the rope. First six for Ahmad uh, Basim. I don't think this one will be greeted with much of a look either from Plunkett, but it's a, a terrific shot. What an over so far, 10 runs from it, 6 and a 4. 218 now. He's on 46, Ahmad. It's beat next, recover. No uh, dive from Moen Ali, so it's a boundary, and it's a boundary that brings a 50 for Imad. It's come off just 57 balls, much needed in support of Safraz, and now has to take things on on his own. Very intelligent shot. He knew the fielders. Midoff was up in the circle. Opened the face of the bat to create that gap between extra cover and midoff fielder. <laughs> Plunkett is not very happy. He's a little stiller this time and flips it away. Back for the second and keep the strike, which is clearly to his advantage. And hooks a, a short, fast ball from Mark Wood. It, something on it, I think. Don't know whether it's a glove, top edge, but it was a lively bouncer that's gone to the fence.